Back here on 10 Tampa Bay this evening, you're taking a live look outside at Clearwater Beach. Yeah, so I think I see a couple people down there enjoying it. Nice day. It's nice been and getting calm too. increasingly nicer this week to get out there. Hey, but the next time that you hit the beach, there might be some big changes to rules when it comes to smoking. There are some bills that are going to make some changes that are moving forward in the state legislature. And today, a state house committee unanimously approved its version of the bill. So let's get right to our Aduria Chumba live at Lido Key with what this means for beachgoers. Aduria. I just spent a few minutes just scanning this area to see if I could find any cigarette butts and I found just one, this one hanging around, which shows you that the people who come here are pretty responsible. But that's not the case at many other beaches where you see that even though there are trash cans to dispose of the cigarette butts properly, you tend to see them littering the sands. And that's something that lawmakers want to stop because it's affecting the environment. There is, uh, I think, a growing awareness of the threats to oceans and coasts in Florida. Um, and I think there is a growing willingness on behalf of the legislature to do something about it. This bill, if passed into law, will give cities and counties the authority to ban smoking cigarettes at the beach. Local leaders can also decide to create designated smoking sections and what type of fines to levy against violators. Florida Senator Joe Gritters of Sarasota has long supported the measures of the bill with the state Senate's version. According to Ocean Conservancy, cigarette butts are one of the major sources of pollution at beaches along with plastic. Animals are deeply affected by cigarette butt plastic. We've seen pictures of um, birds feeding cigarette butts to their chicks. We've seen cigarette butt plastic accumulating in the guts of fish. Um, and so if we can um, reduce the amount of plastic in the environment, we can alleviate those impacts on our wildlife. And just to give you some perspective, Ocean Conservancy said last year at one of their beach cleanups, they picked more than 180,000 cigarette butts that littered the beach and they would have ended up in the ocean. So just to show you what kind of problem they're dealing with, and I'll definitely make sure I find a good trash can for this single uh, butt that I found out here today. Yeah, yikes. All right, thanks, Adore. Gross when you think about it. Uh, really gross. Taking a deeper dive here on how other states handle public smoking, some local governments ban it on beaches altogether. According to the American Non-Smokers Rights Foundation, Massachusetts leads with 69 municipality bans. It's followed by California. They've got 64, New York at 42, Minnesota 31, and then you see New Jersey has 19.